So today we've taken the initiative to head to a different beach rather than Coral Bay again and I'm not sure if this beach is called Sunset Beach or something but this is what it looks like it's quite beautiful it's a bit quieter than the other beach too it should be nice Okay, so now we're just chilling at this beach here. Yeah, it cost us 10 euros for the both of us to use the sunbeds. It's pretty nice here. The water here is, oh, the sand firstly is like not as much sand, it's more pebbles. And also as soon as you get in the water, it just drops off like super fast. Like you're in the, the there's like f a, a one meter and a half of like shallow water. And then afterwards it just drops down super deep. So that's why there's less people here because you can't really bring your kids here and your family. Like the Coral Bay is more flat. But here's nice if you don't want to hear any kids because <laughs> <laughs> there's no kids here. But yes, let's enjoy! So we've been here a few hours now. I think we're gonna chill here for sunset. It's really nice, I'm really enjoying this beach. So yeah, literally right after this wave in there is where the water just drops off completely. And then here we have some a little bit of sand and then rocks and then sand and then rocks again. <laughs> this is the most amount of waves that we've seen so far in Cyprus. Oh, and this is what the beach, the rest of the beach looks like from this side beautiful the beach here is also with a lifeguard until a certain time of day um, and also the shower here is free here are the little beach showers love it And we're back at our little spot here on the beach. Thank you. They told me after six, so they have no more service. Maybe this is all. You can be naked there, but in a corner.
good morning this is our last full day in Cyprus unfortunately but we have an exciting day planned ahead today we have our boat trip and our Jeep trip Jeep and deep to be exact so we're just walking to the pickup point. We're a little bit early at the moment, which is better than being late. And we finally said goodbye to our little Moto Moto. We have like a 15 or 13 minute walk to the hotel where the Jeep is gonna pick us up. And then the adventure begins. So that's the plan. See? Only one year, the tree. Yeah. And uh, when we have the new fruit, the harvest, in October, start in October, we take the fruit, you see some fruit there, yeah, and there, some fruit, mm -hmm. but now the... It's the owner, it's the owner, I think, huh? of the garden. Yeah. Are you the owner of the garden? Yeah, yeah. Huh? He's a farmer. <laughs> it's just two years ago. Yeah. <laughs> Go to Greece and had an engine failure in the deep sea. And so, it, due that the wind is coming from the west, always, uh, carried the ship and sit, sit on the rocks and stay there for 14 years. Uh, now it's a big nest for fishes and attraction for the scuba divers and also for uh, people like to make snorkeling. So we started the tour off officially and we're just at some of the caves. The, yeah, so here's the caves and then up ahead we have the big shipwreck. So here's a more closer view of the boat and a more further away view of the caves. <laughs> it's pretty big. Apparently there's lots of fish under there. It'd be a cool place to snorkel. Nice. This is our private yacht.
which through the centuries has inspired poets and authors. The baths themselves are surrounded by dense natural vegetation comprising many different kinds of shrubs and trees, hiding in their midst the small idyllic pool shaped out of the rock itself and covered by a centuries-old fig tree. It was here, in the crystal clear water of the pool, redolent with the fragrances of a variety of plants and trees, that Aphrodite would enjoy a luxurious bath, far from the prying eyes of mere mortals. Imposing Sodira Peak, you can see the picturesque chapel of St. George. This beautiful church in Marbrook Bow, we see the island of St. George. We'll be slowing down and sailing around this small island. Here, you may want to make your way down to I think we're approaching. I'm not exactly sure where we're going. Maybe like in there. Maybe there. Where Maybe there. there. <laughs> nice view. It's just me and the captain. It's your captain speaking. Look, they have a big slide. It's making a video. Okay, so now that we've come off the boat tour, I can say that it was very good. How long did it take, do you think? Two hours or something? Yes, we was there at 10. We had one hour in the water there, so it took longer than two hours. 45 minutes. 45 minutes each way and then an hour in the water there. But yeah, it was really good. The water, it was beautiful. Like, it was so, so clear and really nice and fresh like definitely would recommend at least doing like a boat tour we were at the blue lagoon for our boat tour which was yeah really good i really enjoyed it we also got some wine and some fruit um on the boat for free or included i guess and yeah it was really really enjoyable i really had a good time now we have one hour in this small town here Guys, look at this lime. Tastes very good. Tastes very good. It's very good. That was my chance to drive the Jeep.
This statue of Aphrodite is the biggest in Greece and Cyprus. Ten meters tall. God of War, Mars. And the new version of Aphrodite, the small one statue, you see? Ah, yeah. <laughs> not shy like that. Yeah. <laughs> Having fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's more open. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Alexander the Great, the king of Macedonia. They have things to see first. I think everywhere is the same. Who is that? Che Guevara, it's Argentina. Rosario, Argentina. And people. This statue is the statue of the owner, of Mr. Pambo. Ah. Maybe we'll see him later inside. I'll show you. Yes, the father of God and people. Okay, this is the lake. You saw the lake. Let's go. go. Thank you. <laughs> 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 you saw a lot of uh, statues outside. And this is my statue when I was a baby. The water was coming from a shadow that we have from the channel through on the internal of the internal ground. And when it crashed on the internal ground, it made ground to ground. They put the wheat between the two stones and they crashed and made the flower for the bread. And they put the flower there with some water, some other things, and they bake the bread, and then they put in this wooden fork to make it round, the bread round, and they stay for two or three hours to go up, and then they put in the oven, and then they had the, the bread. magic waterfall it was extremely beautiful extremely refreshing and would 100% recommend this is our jeep for the trip we can fit eight inside this is my boyfriend ah, sorry this is my beautiful lovely god sent God sent boyfriend. The our tour guide driver said that it, there's like the rumor that the Aphrodite's rocket should swim around it to achieve all the greatness and beauty and everything that you need in life. He said that I didn't need to swim around it because I'm just so stunning already. Can absolutely agree. <laughs> okay, so now that we are back at the apartment, I can give my honest review of the tour. <laughs> No, just joking, but I really, really had a good day on the tour today. I would 100% recommend. 
Um, although it costs 60 euros for the whole tour, I would definitely think that it's worth it because all the things that we did, like the fuel to get the places, the boat trip, the um, entry to the lagoons and the things like that, all would have costed, as it is, almost the same price as the tour itself. Plus we got the extra information from our tour guide and like a nice little group to do the tour with and you can just relax and they bring you everywhere without having to stress about where to go and you know that you have a day planned. It was really good. I really enjoyed all the spots that we visited today. They were awesome and yeah, learned a lot about the island today. I think this is pretty much the end of my video. Now we're just going to go chill out in the pool, clean up our things because tomorrow morning at 3 a.m. we're flying back to Berlin. So that's the end of our holiday. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and comment below. And yeah, see you guys in the next one. Bye.